when I was in high school, I grew up in a lower middle class family and uh, played lots of sports. My father used to sing a lot, but more sort of Roger Whittaker and uh, sort of classic Canadian folk music. Um, and it was in high school I had the experience to hear a choir. I was in a, in a church and heard this, uh, this choral music that I hadn't been exposed to before. And it, it was almost like uh, in that moment, art chose me. It certainly wasn't something that was necessarily a, a central part of my upbringing. But in that moment, sort of art and culture, this great choral music from 100 years before reached out and grabbed me and really inspired me. And uh, since then, I've really been determined to try to create those kinds of experiences and transformative opportunities for everyone. Well, as uh, the National Dance Training Institution for the country, it's really important that we play a central role not only in helping build a creative society through arts education programs, but also helping smaller arts organizations that are emerging in our fields and the next generation of great ideas uh, develop. So in addition to doing work within the public school context, community arts context, working with uh, dance organizations that are smaller, that don't have the benefit of the 50 years of history that we have to ensure that they're robust, successful participants in the community and that they're afforded the same opportunities that our institution was afforded when it was founded back in 1959. I think what's great about Culture Days is that it really is a national celebration of what we do every day. And so, you know, many people will say every day is, every day is a culture day, and that is true. But I think it's a real opportunity for us to really uh, drive attention around the fact that, uh, that culture revitalizes, creates, um, enhances every community constantly. And I think it's just a great day for the community uh, collectively, coast to coast to coast, to celebrate that fact and to participate in a shared activity. I think as a member of the arts community, what we're hoping to realize from participation in Culture Days is, is really a, a much more profound national sense of culture and what Canadian culture is. And I think as we all work together, we'll build a, a much more uh, engaged Canadian uh, society and citizenship. And beyond that, of course, that leads to enhanced understanding amongst our government funders and other supporters of the value of the arts and culture. So I think the, the economic argument is maybe the second one. First and foremost is really about engaging and transforming individual lives, but then collectively, hope, hopefully, we can reshape uh, the nation.